studies of various identified directions by tremendous traffic being noticed to propose solutions towards better traffic management system for the people of town. We know that India is a cooperative nation with the second largest road network in the world that requires safest and comfortable journey to any one destination with improved advancements in the traffic system. When roads are properly maintained along with responding to human behavior, a better traffic system is maintained. Traffic jam is a major problem in our modern lifestyle, sometimes leaving as one of the reasons for road accidents. Many billions of rupees are lost annually as a result of traffic delays, which prevents workers from being productive and left goods are on the road for a longer time instead of being transported to the destination. Other reasons like ongoing construction, accidents, excessive traffic on one route, erratic traffic signals, and presence of potholes and excess of pedestrians are also causing traffic congestion. So, there will be necessity to investigate deeply on various traffic issues in order to facilitate road users with better traffic management system, ensuring safety, faster, economical, and compatible movement of vehicles and people on the roadway. Nuram, which is a part of the Chupadavari district in Andhra Pradesh, named as one of the most populated and with more traffic issues. As it is the only nearby town for many surrounding villages with good number of facilities, people frequently travel here. Well, you all have done your uh, community service project. So I am very much interested to know a few facts and a few understandings from all of you. So, can someone say, uh, and uh, how does this uh, traffic studies would help uh, to provide a better traffic management system for a town like Bimoram? Anyone from your end? Sir, I think conducting traffic studies will enable us to understand the current traffic scenario and transportation system of any municipality. It is very crucial to find origin and destination of people, which is the basic input uh, in order to carry out uh, simulation studies and uh, to prepare traffic model. Uh, traffic demand can be forecasted using these studies, which help us to provide better solution, which can fulfill public need. Well, that was an amazing answer by uh, Sunita. Thank you very much. And here is another thing which, uh, which strikes me uh, right now. Uh, second one I would like to know, uh, what are the most common uh, you know, uh, kind of uh, uh, problems or issues that people would face, uh, you know, that you have encountered during your uh, traffic studies? Uh, so, anyone from your end? Yeah, please. Yeah. 
we observe some of the difficulties during our traffic survey like absence of street lights traffic lights and potholes and some of the accident prone areas which are not indicating like both which are not indicated by placing both there and some of the open drainage systems which cause lot of accidents at night times and due to this potholes also drivers can they try to avoid that pothole but in accidentally they put the tire into the pothole like this also there is a chance of accidents so well that that, that was a very good answer so, uh, i understood that people are faced with you know uh, issues uh, during late night when they travel in particular roads be having no uh, proper signal for proper street lights uh, you recommend providing a proper street light and working at the correct conditions that's that's very nice thank you uh, you need cover it Good There is one more uh, thought process in my mind right now. I would also like to know because you people are all doing, uh, you know, uh, wearing caps and uh, wearing your, you know, apron, uh, noting down all these values. So many public, uh, so so much of public would have uh, seen all of you. So can someone say what is the public perception uh, towards the studies that you have carried out? So can someone say express your uh, comments? How did this public react? To? towards your studies yes sir yeah. good evening sir yeah. uh, while doing traffic survey project people came forward and said that the roads are very narrow due to this narrow roads road accidents are taking place to avoid this accidents they asked for road encroachment sir all right many people are not following the traffic rules after conducting this traffic survey people got awareness and uh, following the traffic rules and we have suggested some uh, safety measures and people gave a positive feedback and by this uh, we have noticed that the minimum changes come in this society so it is that people have a very good uh, feedback we have received during this uh, uh, period of study so people are expecting that you uh, young engineers would bring the rapid change it will be more of traffic isn't it yes yes sir. great very great very great so yeah you have all answered very nicely for the kind of questions that i had in my mind but i would also like to know one more left thing which is very important that i am getting in my mind which i can't stop asking you all so one thing is very important compatibility of people you know travel or ride on a road so can someone comment on this how do you ensure that people safety or the their compatibility levels Uh, while they ride on the you know road this someone yeah this uh, come here in this survey we haven't done the compatibility analysis in our survey sir uh, there are some parameters like level of service through which uh, we can able to understand the compatibility of uh, road and the user uh, so in our phase two survey we are trying to uh, conduct these compatibility studies also so that uh, there would be uh, getting a grade of the road current uh, scenario of the traffic uh, as well, as far discussed uh, we will be entering uh, this data into a simulation tool so that uh, we will be understanding the present uh, traffic condition and the pro- proposed model of the traffic uh, so that uh, a better solution can be provided uh, for the traffic uh, current traffic scenarios so you would like to say that there is something called the term level of service for a given road So you want to try to find out the level of service uh, so that you will get a grade of uh, level of grade for the particular road and see that you will provide a solution so that that solution would give a better grade. So that makes sure that people have a very better compatibility. That's a great answer. I must surplus all of you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, we know India is the most populated country among us all, and also it is standing top uh, in terms of road accidents. And if you look at the statistics of road accidents, we have a huge. number of road accidents like in terms of lakhs every year and also uh, we have lakhs of road accident deaths uh, frequently leaving a lot of families uh, getting affected losing their uh, you know lives of people so yet the government is taking a lot of precautionary steps uh, and imposing a lot of rules and regulations among uh, people but as we are seeing significant number of road accident deaths so as a part of it uh, as an edu- educational institution uh, We, uh, department students and department have taken adopted dimoram town to uh, go uh, to carry out the topic studies so that to propose a better solution uh, to provide uh, and to ensure the safety of people who are most on any topic stream so i congratulate the entire team of uh, students from third b tech to 
have taken this uh, the, their community service project. I must congratulate all of you for doing this. And uh, we make sure that we, the proposal will be submitted to the municipality to make them uh, you know, implement this proposal, whatever we give solution in our project. So hopefully we would like to see uh, the implementation part of our project very soon. So uh, I we thank the institutional support which is provided to the uh, students. So let's see. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.